everyone, my name is Thomas and welcome back to another video on my channel and this is going to be tutorial 2. Now in tutorial 2 I'm going to show you how to build this 3x3 three three piston door. So yeah, um, if you just take a look at the opening and the closing, so this is the closing, this is a very fast and then the opening uh, is also really fast. Now I'm actually going to teach you how to build the door but I'm going to show you how the door actually works because it's just observers all it is is a bunch of observers now if you did see my other video how to build the um the super door one of those uh, hipster door things i will um you go and check out that video on my channel but yeah today i'm going to show you how to build this now for the now closing yeah i'm going to try and explain you what actually is going to happen when i open it so what's going to happen in the opening uh, is this block, these three blocks are going to be retracted back into the wall like that. Then also this, uh, these two blocks will be retracted back in the wall. Um, but yeah, if we just quickly do that. So yeah, if we just break out these blocks. So I'm actually going to show, because this is the most important part of the build. So I'm just going to add some blocks here. There you go. So... What's actually going to happen? This piston is going to go down because of this piece of redstone. That's going to go down, making everything go like uh, making everything go down like that. And this piston is going to grab this. This piston is then going to grab that down. And then this double, and then uh, this piston extend, pushing it there, and then a full uh, retraction, which will do the entire thing. So if we go and put in the door, or how it was before, put it so it does just the normal door like that. Some uh, quartz. That there. And if we flip the lever, as you can see, it will go down and then open. So yeah, let's get into the tutorial. Okay, so for this build, you are going to need. Uh, so for this tutorial you are going to need two droppers eight observers one lever or lever two redstone repeaters six pieces of redstone ten stick pistons and one piston mainly because that that block right there is the um the uh thing that will update that observer and you're also going to need just a handful of blocks so yeah let's get into the tutorial so so uh this is what that we're going to be building so you uh, i'm just going to grab a handful of blocks like that and we're just going to build it right next to me. Now you're probably going to get a little bit bored of saying the word observer. Because I'm going to be saying that t uh, eight times in total. So the first thing you want to do is place an observer facing uh, that way. Like that. Then we're going to put um, a block in front of that block. I mean that observer. And then a dropper there. So that should be um, one dropper used. Now we're going to have a, uh, yeah, we're going to have an observer facing this way with our block on top with our piece of redstone. Then we're going to put an upwards of observer of this block, which will detect the changes from that. And then we're going to have an observer facing... Oh, I don't know what way that's facing. Okay. Go ahead and fix that. 
Mm. And then observer facing this way. Then we're going to add uh, two sticky pistons right there. Yep. Then we're going to add our uh, one piston, which is going to be facing there. We'll update that observer. And then we're going to need a block right here and a block above. And this is going to be, uh, you're going to have three blocks right there. And then, um, yeah, um, let's see. You're going to put another block there and you're going to just make our uh, three by three piston door. There you go. So that, sh that uh, believe it or not, is the bottom circuit done. Don't think I've forgotten anything. No, I haven't. So the next thing you're going to do is you're going to put an observer facing. <laughs> Sorry. Then I'm going to make sure if there's anything. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Uh, I absolutely forgot about that. Just quickly. Oops. Probably one of the worst tutorials, but. And you're also going to need to place a stick piston in that gap like that. And that is the end of that circuit. Then on top of this block, you're going to put a piece of redstone like that. With another observer facing uh, like that, facing upwards, same as that observer. And that should be correct. Then you're just going to add three sticky pistons that are going to go right here. Whoops. Three sticky pistons. And then you're going to add uh, two sticky pistons right there. And on top of that, you're going to put a dropper. And that's all your dropper is complete. Then on top of that dropper, you're going to put a piece of redstone dust. And then you're going to put a block on top of that. And that is going to be your beaver uh, output. Or, um... So you use the button output. Oh, I need a better camera. For God damn it! We've got my video done. And have a stick like this, which is gonna suck. No, this doesn't look too bad. There you go. Then I'm going to put off this redstone. On the side of this redstone, you're going to put, uh, not your droppers, you're going to put two observers. Like that. Then on top of those two observers, you're going to put two repeaters. Like that. Sorry if you could hear background noises, there's a few things going on. And I put a four tick on that repeater. Then, you're going to just build up uh, three blocks like that. Let's do that. And then put uh, two stick pistons down. Like that. Now for the tricky part. We're going to put a block right here. And then we're going to put a piece of redstone there. And then another uh, block right there. And you can get rid of that one with another piece. And then a uh, another block right there with our piece of redstone and that is going to power these two sticky pistons and then you're going to place an observer facing this way but i want you to do is break this and then put this in and then just you can fix back this um block like that and then place your piece of redstone because we don't want that all sticking out those blocks um and i think I think that might be everything done. Just checking if everything's done, making sure everything is correct. But yeah, now we can go up here, flick the lever and test it. Oh, why is that not working? I must have done something that doesn't make that work.
I'll be back, guys. I'm back. Just make sure you place a block in front of that. So now if we test it. Hmm. There is definitely something not working. That is allowing us not... Okay, guys, I'm back. Um, what the problem was is I actually forgot to place an observer facing there. And I just noticed it here. So that there's an observer facing into that bottom sticker piston. That's why it all wasn't functioning. We forgot to put all that um, special uh, block there. But now we can fill in this door. I'm going to quickly go in for this door. And we should have, hopefully... A working door. Let me just quickly go and place in the block so we can actually see if this works because it's really, really hard to see if this thing is working or not because all the blocks are different. There you go. Right, let's test it. Hmm. Okay, guys, I'm back. Um, what happened was this observer is facing the wrong way. It's supposed to be facing downwards. And that should do, uh, that should complete the bottom circuit. So that was just a little mistake we, um, we did. So now if we test it, yep, everything is working. Except this, I don't know what's happening there. I'll be also, I'll be, uh, no, we could probably check now, actually, and see what's causing that. Um, wonder what? The observer's facing you in the right way, maybe? We are facing the right way, I know that for sure. This video is long. It's already it's already twelve it's almost twelve minutes. Server facing that way, yeah, that's right. Oh yeah. I forgot to place a little piece of redstone there. Right now if we test it, that works, and if we press it again. There you go, now it all works. So all we need to do now is um, fill in the door like that. Um, yeah, just to make sure is when this observer should be facing downwards. There should be an extra observer which is facing um, into the block like that. Um, I, I don't need to put a dropper there. Um, uh, and you've got to make sure that the repeaters are on the same tick, that, uh, that's good. But yeah, if you did enjoy this video, you can also do it on the other side as well. Uh, quickly go. Let's quickly go and do this. Whoop. Okay. So yeah, um. So yeah, if you did enjoy this video. Uh. Make sure to like it. If you really, and that's all I've got time for today. If you really liked it, make sure to subscribe. Uh, if you liked it, make sure to like it. I don't know what I'm saying. I'll be back with a better intro. If you enjoyed it, make sure to like. And if you um, loved it, make sure to subscribe. This is Super Mario Thomas, and I'm out. Peace out, guys.